exercise. Are you ready to do your stretches? You are? Good. Okay. Now, hands on your hips, feet slightly apart, one arm up and over you go, stretching down if you can. That's it. Well done. Now, we're going to swap arms. Arms out, over to the other side on your hip and stretching over that way. Oh, good job. Now, we're going to see if we can touch the floor. My back's a little bit difficult, so I'll see how far down I can go. Arms up high and all the way. Oh, that might be as far as my back lets me go today. Can you go any further? Oh, good job. You're much better than me. Now, shake those legs. Shake those legs. Shake those arms and your shoulders. Oh, do some stretches. Well done. And very carefully do your head and shake it all out. Are you ready? Because today we're going to do some jumping. And I've got some sheets of paper. Now let's count the sheets. We've got one, two, oh, I wonder how many is going to be here. Oh, excuse me, Bertie. Three. Bertie wants to help do the filming. He's very close to the camera. <laughs> We've got one, two, three, four. Five. Now, I'm going to jump between the sheets of paper. Have you got any paper? Or you could use cushions. As long as it's safe and you're grown up, say it's all right. Are you ready? I'm going to do some jumping. Oh, I hope my back holds out on this one. We're going to go one, two, three. Jump, jump, jump. Ralph likes to help me do this and true to form he's come over to watch to see if he can guess what's in the bag. Oh let's have a look. Oh I'm a bit excited about this Bertie. I'm gonna take a look. Let's have a look. Oh oh well it's long and it's made up of different parts to make the long thing. It's got a handle and I think that's made out of silicone, which is a kind of plastic, I believe. And at the end of that, which is a handle, there's a little square hole. Hmm, so it's made out of plastic. It's a handle. I can hold it in one hand. Um, now what's next? Now in the middle, there's some metal. There's some metal. It's a rectangle of metal that goes all the way round the thing. And there's some writing on it. Well, actually, one side says it's called stainless steel. But that's a kind of metal. And the other side says, oh, it's a measurement. It says it's 50 millimetres. Oh, that's quite good. Or it's two inches. That's an old fashioned way of telling different kinds of measurements. And there's a name. Hmm can't quite read that name. Oh, now at the end of this long thing, there is some bristles or the, rather there are some bristles. There are some bristles and they, I think, are made of plastic as well. I think they're made of nylon. That's a different kind of plastic. Could be getting all these names wrong, couldn't I? I think I've got them right though. Mm. So it's a long thing with a handle with a metal bit in the middle and bristles at the end. And there's some drips of stuff on it. It's got drips of white and drips of a purpley pink. Hmm, something drippy. It must do something drippy. <gasps> Ralph, did you say what I think you said? Did you hear what Ralph said? He's got it right. Good boy, Ralph. Well done. Oh, he looks at his proud face. <gasps> Bertie, did you get it right as well? 
Oh, Bertie's got it right. Oh, don't worry, Enzo. Oh, it doesn't matter if you don't get it right, Enzo. Just keep thinking and in a minute we'll find out. Are you ready? I'm going to hold it. I wonder if you got it right. You did! You are super clever. My voice went all high then, didn't it? Let's have a look. This is the end bit made out of plastic with a square hole. And then you've got the metal bit there that says stainless steel. It goes all the way round. And the bristles. Yes, that's right, Ralph. It's a brush, a decorator's brush to paint the walls or to paint your woodwork. Look. And there are the drips. We must have painted some white paint. And there's some bits not very well cleaned off of the bristles. And there's a little bit of pink there too. Did you guess it? Good job. Well done. I'll see you next time on Stretcher Size. Bye-bye.